Dallas has a population of 6.8 million. It's the seventh largest metropolitan area in the U.S., and these numbers are rising. This has led to an increased strain on social services to address the needs of at-risk families, especially those that may also have a child born with chronic special medical and educational needs, including those infants exposed to HIV AIDS. We are also bracing to serve children born with the Zika virus. Brian's House is the only agency that meets a unique service gap in eight Dallas counties. Over the last 29 years, Brian's House has served 18,000 children impacted by HIV AIDS and those that have special medical, educational, and therapeutic needs. Today, 1,200 people, including 600 children, are impacted from the direct child care and education model, casework, and family supportive services which addresses emergency housing and homeless prevention for families so they can gain support to thrive. All children receive a national accredited education using the high scope curriculum and if needed, on-site therapy individualized to pace to their abilities and development stage in life. Many women served at Brian's house are single mothers who have been sex trafficked, abandoned, or abused. Children born into these families are many times the forgotten ones. Brian was the first infant to die of AIDS in the U.S. And now we need those who supported those efforts to establish the agency to return to Brian's house and connect again. For more information, go to www.bryanshouse.org or connect on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn.